Looks like you have some box. It's Steve Foster. How are you doing, Steve? Good, Luke. Good. Yeah, so I was watching you there with um, with Ben, getting him prepped for his uh, his fight a week Friday in the Ultimate Boxer. How's camping going? It's going good. Uh, he's doing everything he asked for him. He, things even better than you know, what I thought he could have done. Uh, I'm just enjoying my new career as well, you know, training and that, and then putting whatever I know, my experience and knowledge into other fighters. So it's going good. Good to hear. You know, how have you found that transition? You know, from coming from a, you know, such a, a distinguished uh, professional career yourself to trying to transition that into becoming a trainer. How do you find it? Well, easy really, because that's what I've done, I? So I suppose it's just different in trying to explain it in your type of way. I suppose different people are better at speaking and whatever else. But for me and Ben are on a bit of a level, so we understand each other. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, picked up on that when I was speaking to Ben earlier. There does seem to be that connection there already. You know. Um, in the short time you guys have been working together, uh, you seem to be able to push him uh, again right to his limits and, and be able to bring out that, that extra um, five or ten percent in him to, to push him right the way. Yeah, it's the, the extra oomph. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, no, uh, it's, you know what it is. It's about working with a fighter. And every every fighter is different, uh, and it's about knowing when to push and when to not. You know, try and just see the little bit of change in them, and if they need a rest, they need a rest. And, Went to up, up the pace and whatever else, so I can find I can do that with Ben. Really? Right, now, um, obviously, you know, mentioned to Ben, you, know, you don't want to overlook any opponent, but you know, ideally, how would you see uh, the rest of the year playing out uh, for Ben Mosley? Hopefully, get a couple more fights in. Uh, I'd say three fights before you know before Christmas or something, and then go from there. And hopefully, his, his name's back in the mix, he's established again, and people's got titles. Who obviously Ben's a good name. To, to put on their record to try and win, but obviously Ben's there to beat them and just hopefully get the fight since to get him a title fight. To be fair, mm -hmm. no, obviously you know looking at yourself as a trainer, you know you're training Ben at the minute. Is there any plans to expand the, the stable? Are you looking at taking anyone else on? Anyone's more than welcome to come, but I'm not. I'm not crying for fighters. I'm not. I'm not my bad, You know, uh, if they come, they come. But at the minute, I'm, I'm happy just concentrating on Ben. Really. Well, uh, thanks for inviting us down to the gym today, mate. Thanks for your time and all the best. Thank you, mate. Tom.